we're gonna pile up sandbags next to the doors. So, um, if we actually do get a flood, water wouldn't come into the rooms, I guess. Up against the uh, like the garage door. Right, so I guess we're gonna have to put like the matches against the garage door. No, I've been wanting to buy special sandbags for that one. on these sandbags, but they're all wet, so they're not going to work. Uh -huh. That's what that opening is for. Big bags. Can hold the water actually. more. 
open bag. There is? Yeah. I guess I'm going to use one of these. Probably this one. Stop saying signs of the earth. Yeah. both of these bags right here against this door we're gonna get the bags we're gonna get some probably some of these bags right over to that door right over there this door right over there we're gonna get some bags over there too Okay, three of them. Yeah. Started putting uh, sandbags near the door of uh, the backyard. About five of them stacked up together. was just editing a video of yesterday, I guess. So, um, today's the 6th of October. So, um, yeah.
southwest one foot at five seconds. Bay and inland waters choppy. Scattered thunderstorms. Numerous showers, mainly in the evening. Tuesday, east winds 15 to 20 knots with gusts up to 25 knots. Seas 2 to 4 feet, occasionally to 5 feet. Wave detail, east 3 feet at 4 seconds and west 2 feet at 11 seconds. Bay and inland waters choppy. Scattered thunderstorms. Scattered showers in the morning, then numerous showers in the afternoon. Tuesday night, east winds 20 to 25 knots with gusts up to 30 knots, becoming southeast 25 to 30 knots with gusts up to 45 knots after midnight. It's the next morning out. It's back basically 6 o'clock, so still got the sandbags up near the door. Um, hold up. We don't have sandbags right there yet, but hey. So, yep. We're getting ready. Um, basically, Milton's strengthened into a category two. So, um, yep. This is just editing a video here. I'm gonna turn on the light. King Milton is um, strengthening into a, a category two. So it is raining right now because my phone's wet, everything's wet around here. Basically, um, the Milton is heading towards a category two now, which, yeah. I can barely see the sky now because there's a bunch of clouds. Well, all I know is that we're ready for the hurricane to hit us, I guess. It is currently freaking pouring out here now. Um, I'm outside and it is uh, freaking pouring. Look at this, bruh. It's so freaking pouring out here. It's kind of pouring. My phone is freaking wet. Um, it's literally um, it's dark out again. Yep. Right then, it's currently 6:28 while I'm recording this. The hurricane has striked to our category four. And we're getting prepared for it to hit our state in a few days. Yeah. It's common, man. It's common. I don't know how bad this is going to be, I swear. Just don't know. Hello guys, my name is Valku and welcome to a um, video. <laughs> it's um, October 8th and uh, yep, I'm uh, going to show you the category of the hurricane. Um, basically, I'm out of category 5 right now. So, um, uh, so yeah. I've been gone for about 6 not six days. Three days, by the way, I've been gone, so, um, yeah. Basically, um, 
be gone from YouTube because um, I'm going to be gone for more than three days because of this freaking hurricane named Milton, by the way. So, um, yeah, just to, up you, just to update you, I guess it's October 8th, 2024. Very close to the end of this year. We're going to be hitting 2025 in just a few months. So, yeah. Crazy how we've went this far in 2024. Yeah. Yeah. Right then, um, it's October 9th and the hurricane has slightly came close to Florida and is about to hit us. So, um, I don't know how long we'll stay clear in this hurricane. I mean, how I don't know how long we'll stay clear in the hurricane, from the hurricane, I guess. But, uh, hey. We are prepared. Remember, Poinciana sits in two counties. Yeah. Yeah. It sits in Polk and Osceola. It's going to go over the I-95 corridor between Canada and River Park. This is where everybody lives around uh, the, you know, this part of Florida. There's an unbelievable amount of neighborhoods here. You can tell that uh, this is probably somewhat new development, too. Uh, so uh, please take shelter now if you live near Port St. Lucie. This is an extremely dangerous storm. Now, our PBS tornado warning uh, is continuing right now. It's near uh, Lake Placid. Big tornado on the ground doing significant damage uh, just to the south. of have got to shelter now. Uh, let's come back over here to uh, the storm. Near, um, My mom getting in the uh, Fort Runner. Um, There's the truck right there. Uh, you guys are still under It is raining out right now. Crazy rain. There's a mattress out there that's freaking wet. You're all dead! Tornado warning for freaking Osceola County! Yeah, I just got a warning on my phone about it. I wish it was not raining. I do not want it to end up like 2022. Freaking two years ago. This is Helene's boyfriend.
not exactly flooded yet. But um, I guess um, when it gets flooded, then they'll open the gates, the flood gates, I guess. Like when the aftermath happens, I guess. But now we're just experiencing some uh, minor winds. Projection says it's going across the street. It's Why not you... going across the. It's going northeast. Why not you have the same thing? Somewhere it seems like that. Can I have an example now? I know it's already. I don't think it's. It has occurred. We're not barely getting. We're, we're not barely getting, getting anything. You want to know why? Because it's not going across the street. It's going northeast. I know it is. I can tell. That Look means that. George it's is going to get it. Or Georgia, do we? George is going to get this storm. Yeah, I know. They right. don't realize they're in protected path now. Yeah, I know. It's not going across like they said it was. Alright, so um, about, about around 2 a.m. in the morning, we're, uh, my mom and my probably my sisters are going to be checking that uh, creek we live right next to. Um, like right over there. I guess right over there where I'm facing that wall. It's um, going to be going. We're going to be going right over there basically and you're gonna be checking that creek because that creek over there is actually just rising and by around 2 a.m probably around 6 a.m we're gonna be we're gonna be getting floods it's just gonna be nuts actually i don't know like probably i don't know just don't know Literally, there's no power. The neighbors don't have power. The whole county doesn't have power. But we do. So this was a really, really, really devastating hurricane. That, um... It was a wind maker, and uh, basically, it knocked out our power, turning on our generator, and um, the whole entire county of Osceola County, it's in Florida right here, the whole entire county of Osceola has lost power, and uh, tomorrow is the aftermath of Hurricane Milton, so um, yeah. This has been this video of my experience of Hurricane Milton, so yeah. I'm Valku, and I'll see you guys in the next video when things are normal. So yeah.
see ya. Thank you.